So it has been an incredible day of long dirt roads, stinging insects. We'll leave that part out. Country cliffs and amazing vistas all by ourselves here at Basin and Range National Monument. My wife and I want to welcome you to join us today on this video. Good morning, America's Parks. As we said earlier, we are on our way to Basin and Range National Monument right now. We are presently just past the intersection of 375 and 318, and we were told to go about 3.9 miles north of that intersection into the monument itself. Our first stop will be Logan Canyon Road to look for some petroglyphs. landmarks out here at Basin and Range. If you want to go to Mount Irish, you can't go any further with the car. You're hiking it in. We're going to stay on the other side of the fork and make our way toward the petroglyphs. That'd be nice though. Okay, so bare knuckling on the road, Julie. Is that fair to say? Going about uh, nine miles or so to get to this point. Uh, you could do without a four-wheel drive, but a little rough, but not bad. We have finally reached our first petroglyph site. This is Mount Irish Petroglyph Site. If you're coming here, it's not far past the sign that I showed you that said Mount Irish. It's on the right-hand side. We're gonna go explode these rocks right now. Let's go. There right now we made it past that first petroglyph site i think it was echo rock specifically there's one that's further up the road the road is getting really dicey we just did about a 20 point turn in the middle of the road right here we're going to turn around and head back right now All right, as you can see, we're on foot right now. We have changed our attire as well. Yeah, we won't lose you on that shirt. <laughs> and we were told that there's a couple of abandoned mines down this road. Um, 
technically, I guess if you had the right vehicle, you could drive it. But as Julie said, not with the car we have. So we're gonna walk in about a mile so we can find these mines. All right, guys, so we hiked in a ways. We've completely lost the road. Maybe we got on the wrong road, but the road clearly ended. And uh, this is not a spot when you're out here in the middle of nowhere with nobody around that you want to get lost. We built some rock currents on the way out just to trace our steps, but uh, we've gone far enough. We don't see a mine. We're turning back now. So here's another nice petroglyph right here on this hike. They say these things date back to about 1000 BC, but they could also date back to about the 1860s. So you have a range for about 3000 years. The Native Americans made these beautiful designs in the rocks and they're still here and they're still preserved. And we hope that people that come here and visit these incredible sites respect this name alone for future generations. That means it's time to turn around. When it comes to Basin Range, there's three basic districts here. There's the shooting gallery. We didn't go there. That has a lot of like art exhibits. And then there's Mount Iris. We just showed you that on the video thus far. And now we're in our third district and our final district today. This is the White River Narrows. And we understand there's a bunch of spots here that have various petroglyphs. So we're gonna take you to one and I think we're gonna turn around and hit the road. So I hope you enjoy this too. So that'll do it for Basin Range National Monument. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you do come out here, make sure you do your research. Everything was kind of hard to find. Yeah, and we did quite a bit of research and it was still very challenging. So don't use this as a guide. I don't think we presented any misinformation, uh, but if you want to find out really the intimate parts of this incredible monument, kind of look other places. But hopefully this served as a, uh, a lay of the land if you wish to come out here or just for entertainment purposes. We hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, there's always room for you on our next National Park adventure. All right. Thanks. Please subscribe if you haven't.